Digital storytelling is a method that uses the traditional storytelling approach, but then adds digital tools to it. So you can use uh, photography, you can use narration and recording to record your story and create a short film almost. And in our workshop, we did exactly that. We went from telling a story to tweaking it and scripting it, making even a storyboard, and, so, and then went to the digital side. So people were narrating their story using microphones and iPads, and then in the iPad they could straight away edit it and add images to it. A member of staff in each of our branch has now been trained in the digital storytelling method, and there have been sessions running in libraries with community groups and the public. So having decided to do the digital storytelling pilots, we decided to involve libraries because they're at the heart of our communities and they're an ideal location to reach out to people in a wide variety of circumstances. It's a very intuitive process as well, so once the staff are trained, they see that they don't have to be digital wizards to understand and take the, the sort of process forward with people. It's very intuitive, it's very simple, but it still has meaningful impact especially with regards to digital skills, because you don't actually need that much to be able to create this, this story, but it does give you a really good launch pad for progressing with digital skills in the future. I think the Digital Storytelling Project is really important because it's gave uh, participants, including staff and partners, the opportunity to learn digital skills and, and use those skills in a creative way to engage with, with their communities and capture really personal stories. Through the process of making the digital story, you're picking up digital skills and you're doing it in a really fun and creative way. So people are focusing on their own story, so it's very personal, and they're excited to show friends and family at the end of the, at the, end of the process. Um, so it's a really fun, engaging and empowering way for people to tell their stories. The project was very worthwhile and it had a feel-good feeling to it. And now being retired, it's a great opportunity to think, make your brain think. One other very important aim of this project was to leave a legacy and all of the digital equipment that's purchased to do this project is left in the community, in the community library, so that people can continue on with this kind of work, continue to tell their stories and develop their digital skills with the equipment and the legacy that we've left behind people around Scotland, we want to encourage them to see themselves as readers and writers, and in this case as storytellers, as people with something to say, uh, some story to tell that is going to fascinate everybody else, and people do, that everybody has that kind of a story. When we actually put that, the stories on our uh, social media platforms, the views and the comments that we got, what, it was mind-blowing, it, it really was, I've, I've never seen anything quite like it, it was, uh, and the comments were so positive as well. So it's, it's getting their stories out there, it's letting people know, even within the service, what people are going through and being able to share that. It was interesting to hear other people's stories, well, especially when they come north of 70 years anniversary, and what older people tell me stories about when they first moved to Glen Northis and about the community changing over the time. That, I think, would be really good to have in the archives for younger generation to look back on as well. The stories are then shown and shared and this is another aspect of why it was so effective because this sharing enabled a wide range of people from across the community to be given a voice. I, I can't think of a negative impact from this project. All it's done is open doors for people and encourage them to be more digitally adventurous and see that they can um, take these skills forward and that their voice is worth hearing as well. It's opened so many doors, not just within myself as a person, but also in terms of the impact out there in terms of just inspiring people and inspiring lives that it's okay, you can go through a lot, but you can actually still make it. It has changed me for better and forever. I'll never be the same because of this project. I feel so confident. I feel so uh, happy. It's like, you know, I'm just me now because I've found myself, I discovered myself. So really incredible experience.